right, good morning to everyone who's watching this. This is day one of the Human Powered Helicopter Project. And yeah, we're gonna have this whole car filled with everything that we need. We just came to my house and we've now filled the van considerably more, many more bikes. And next we're going to, I believe, Oakville to pick up some stuff. But they'll probably be out in the backyard. That's the so we are stopped to pick up uh, epoxy and supplies at Composites Canada. Uh, sister and uh... and so we finally filled the moving van after completing all the stops, and we've managed to make it double decker with this mattress. So we're gonna put the rest of the bikes on top. Stuff you have expands to the space available. <laughs> so true. 11 and 2 unicycles. I love my It might not be, it might not be the one. Whoa, check out that water buffalo. Alright, so this is day two of the human helicopter project and we've just gotten to the barn after biking in from uh, Tottenham where we're living for the summer. Okay guys, so honestly what we're trying to accomplish here is like nothing short of historic. We need to both design and construct far better than any team has before. Um, and really there's, there's three things I really want to emphasize right from the beginning. We need to work smart not hard. We don't want to get stressed and think, oh man, this is a big epic challenge and we'll just work 24 hours a day until it's done. At every single moment, we need to work smart and we need to think about doing things better, faster, and lighter.